might have to stay in, if I was have doing to stay you, in the tall gear now. I would rather...
Oh, no, 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 collaborated on this one to create the first fall fever race. Uh, it was a bit of a rushed organized event based on all of our schedules and what was available for weekends. Uh, we opted to keep this as a U16 class, so it was a kids only race, no adults this year. Uh, main goal was to try to attract as many first time racers that have never raced or haven't really frequented this bike park. So we broke it into two different groups, U16 and U11. The U16 course uh, had a total course distance of one, just over 1.5 kilometers. U11. Sorry, the U11. Yeah. And the U16 course did the entire back 40, uh, probably back 40 park, uh, com compromised of uh, about 5.5 kilometer race. So what do we say? 33 racers total uh, coming from everywhere around. So there's Nipua, Carberry, and for this point would be BC for the race just happened to be in the area but yeah. um yes it was a good event we had lots of sponsors thanks to home hardware for sponsoring a free barbecue for all the participants and spectators um stream and wood came out from brandon and did free bike tune-ups for all of the riders um what else the nipua king club cooked all, every, all the food handed it out and nipua tourism um also thanks to them and they made all the race plates for the riders that they get to take home as well as a little souvenir so i think it's very successful we were very pleased initially yep. we anticipated we were, the main goal was to get anywhere between 30 and 40 uh riders and we we hit our goal yep. so i'm ecstatic so next year it'll probably be an annual thing we'll maybe do a spring and a fall one yeah 